Hi guys, this is RTM43 and welcome to part 2 of my classic video game collection or NES game collection, whatever, whichever you prefer. Alright, first up is Super Mario Brothers. Everybody knows this game? Should know it. Nothing really to say about that. Next up is Wall Street Kid. It's really just where you're basically on the New York Stock Exchange managing money. And that's really the main purpose of this game. It's okay. If you want a cheap game, it's actually really entertaining. Next up is The Little Mermaid. It's basically, it's a, like a side scrolling shooter, believe it or not. But instead of like your character ha holding a gun, it's, as you see, The Little Mermaid shooting bubbles out of her tail. So. I don't know if this is hard to find, but if anybody can help me out, leave a comment down below. Yep, yeah, right there. And before you guys forget, at the end of this video or sometime during this video, click that big yellow button over there. It says subscribe. Now, I want to try to have at least 60 subscribers by the end of the school year, which is June 10th. Adventures, Adventures of Dino Ricky. This is another game, like a uh, Little Mermaid. I don't know if this is like rare or hard to find. So if anybody, so if anybody can help me out, greatly appreciate it. And haven't really played this game, so can't really say anything about it. So if you have any comments on the game, if I should play it or not. Which I probably will anyway. Leave a comment below. And and Dr. Mario. It's basically like the title says Mario is a doctor. And it's like a Tetris type of game. Where instead of like the blocks, it's actual pill caplet. So, I thought that was pretty funny the first time I played it. Gorilla War. Another basic side scrolling shooter. Really fun. Kind of like if you've ever played POW, it's kind of like that. And that will be in a later video. So, I suggest this one up to go for the wolf. Batman Returns. Okay game. It's a budget price game. So, I suggest you try this one out also. Got two minutes and thirty seconds. Tetris 2. I would say this isn't the easiest game to find, but it's an okay game, but I highly suggest the first one, because this one isn't as good, but it's still an okay game. And surprisingly or not, it come with the instruction booklet, and I got it for $5, so I struck a pretty good deal on that. Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. I know he'll say it's a bad game, but I actually like it. Side scroller adventure game. What can you say? Spy Hunter. Haven't played much about it. Or haven't played much of it. 
so can't really say anything about it. Sky Shark, top down shooter, kind of like 1942 airplanes, bullets. He could be that. Arcade version of Mario Brothers. This is another one of those games that isn't the easiest to find. I could pay five dollars for this one too. And oddly, it came with the instruction booklet for Top Gun Second Missions. So, yep. It's a good game, but I suggest the Mario Brothers series. Other than this, it's not as good. I don't want to say anything about that game. Hook. I bought this because I like the movie. It's really good, but the weapons, the sword is like this small, and it takes ten, it takes like a million hits to kill the guy. So it's a very difficult game. Infiltrator. Top down shooter. DuckTales, kids based, side scroller game. Alright, thanks and subscribe. See you in the next vid.